These are words of Major Claude Etherly, one among the 90 military personnel who took part in the bombing of Hiroshima on August 6, 1945. The B-29 bomber pilot Claude was tasked to assess target visibility prior to the bombing of Hiroshima. But life for Claude after the horrific bombing in the twin Japanese cities of Hiroshima and Nagasaki, in which nearly 2 lakh people died, was of struggle to reconcile with his own conscience. Leafing across the pages of history reveals that Major Etherly was so disturbed by the trauma caused to him that he would reportedly wake up screaming in the aftermath of the attack. Later, he was declared as mentally unstable for his outbursts and was confined in a mental institution. The post-Hiroshima impact drove Major Etherly into self-sabotage and his role in the cruel bombing haunted him till his last days in Houston, where he died of cancer in 1978. But before he passed away, he imagined the world without nukes and war and tried to snuff out his life many a times.